Hello. In this video, we like to solve the following problem. Assume that we have the following reaction that consists of elementary steps of A going to B with a rate constant of K1, B going to C with a rate constant K2. Assume that these reactions are first order. Now, we would like to derive an expression to find the rate of change of the concentration of B and then also an expression for the concentration of B at the steady state. You can pause the video now, attempt a solution, and then restart the video to see how we solve this problem. Welcome back. We can write an expression for the change in the concentration of B over time by noticing two things. One is that the concentration of B increases as A is converted to B, and the rate of that is equal to K1 times A. So the rate of formation of B is equal to the constant K1 times the concentration of A. But B is also being destroyed as it is converted into C, and that occurs with a rate constant K2 times b. So this is positive here, it's going to emphasize and put a positive sign. And then the amount that b is decreasing is equal to k2 times the current concentration of b. So that gives us our expression for the change in the concentration of b over time. Now to find the concentration of b at the steady state, we apply the steady state approximation. And that approximation tells us that the rate of change of B, this intermediate here, is defined to be zero, or assumed to be zero. Now that we have done that, we can add K2 times the concentration of B to each side, which gives us that K1 times the concentration of A is equal to K2 times the concentration of B. Now we divide each side by K2. Which gives us almost immediately our expression for the concentration of B. That the concentration of B at the steady state is equal to K1 divided by K2 times the concentration of A. I thank you very much for your attention. Have a good one.